<laughs> now he is a nice boy. He's a nice boy, but he's... He's what? He he's is what? trash, 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 not for you. Oh. He's nice, but he's trash? How does that make sense? Oh, and the poor guy has to hear all this shit. That is so heartbreaking. I can't imagine how like cru soul crushing it is to hear the person you love's parents talk such shit about you. Yeah. I love him. You are 17 years old. You don't know anything about love. Oh, and you do? You don't look at daddy the way I look at Noah. You don't Whoa! play. You don't know anything about love. Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> Go tell mom. Hey, whoa, whoa, that was rough. Yo, it's me, Chris. You guys see they have this beautiful gray hat on? <laughs> and I'm here with this guy. Hey, it's me, Chris, aka Keenan Spears, aka Woo! Built Different, aka Chubby Random Self of the Flesh of the Guy Your Mom is Always Talking About. And as you can see, we have special guest Adwin. Round of applause for Adwin. Good job. Yes, look at him. He's super, super handsome. Today, we're going to be just having this considered the hardest task on this planet. Let me know what it is. We're watching a movie. Mm, very interesting. But what movie are we watching? We're going to be watching The Notebook. When this drops, Valentine's Day is literally tomorrow. Yes, it's the day after. So we thought, you know what? Let's do one film I've heard so many people like mention in my lifespan, and I never gave enough of a shit to watch it. That's it, man. Apparently, this is like peak romance. All right? It's got romance. It's got Ryan Gosling. It's got Ryan Gosling. What more do you need? What more do you need to say, wow, that sounds romantic? So that's why we're watching it. We're gonna get into the uh, the Valentine's Day uh, spirit. For those of you who have a special somebody in life, and for those of you who are terminally alone, uh, this one's for you guys. But you know who's not terminally alone? The people on the Patreon. They are really? not alone. Why? Because there are many other great people in this planet just like them. Wow, I love them so much. And then we have those of you who are subscribed to the channel, and woo I got a heart for you too. Yee-hee-hee-hee, <laughs> wow! Yeah. But then we have those of you guys who are not subscribed to the channel, and uh, I don't have a heart for you. I have nothing for you on Valentine's Day. You don't get chocolate. No. Nope. You get shit. That's all you get. You get a box of shit. <laughs> oh, that's for you. But hey, you don't have to have a box of shit. All right, you can simply subscribe to the Octocool channel at this very moment, and you too can receive some nice, delectable, mouth-watering chocolates oh. by simply subscribing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're you're welcome. We love you. You're welcome. Give them the notebook, baby. Hit them with it. Give them the notebook. You fly into them. <gasps> ah! All right, look, that's a sick sunset, though. Like, damn, looks nice. Just rowing away. Not a care in the world, rowing off into the sunset. The Notebook. I don't even know what this is about, actually. Dude, I couldn't tell you. I just remember when it came out, like, people were going crazy about it. James Marsden? Yeah. Come on, honey, let's get you ready for bed. Oh, it's bedtime? Oh, sick. Wait, oh, is this like a, um, retirement home, then? I don't know, maybe she's just rich. Maybe, maybe. I have no one special. Just a common man with common thought. <laughs> I've led a common life. There are no monuments dedicated to me, and my name will soon be forgotten. Oh, wow. That's positive, <laughs> right? I've succeeded as gloriously as anyone who ever lived. Looking good, dude. Feeling good. Hey, okay. Hey, my man, we feeling good. For me, that has always been enough. How's it hanging, Harry? I keep trying to die, but he won't let me. <laughs> This is Duke. He's come to read to you. Read? Mm-hmm. Oh, cool. Nice. It was the night of the carnival. Noah was there with his friends Finn and Sarah. Noah? That's where they met. June 6th, 1940. Little man wins a prize. <laughs> little man? Good job, little man. Clobbered that thing. I'm telling you these games are fixed. Hello? Hi. What's your name? Get right up, okay? He missed twice. Happens to the worst of us. My name's Allie Hamilton. She's here for the summer with the family. Dad's got more money than God. Oh. Than God! Look, I won your prize! What is that thing? It's a lamb! Oh, I thought it was a rat. You wanna dance with me? No. 
Shit! She's with us. Hey, Alec, you want to ride the Ferris wheel? I'd love to. All right. Oh, oh, damn, that was rough. At least you tried, bro. You gave it a shot. No, I'm surprised you even came over. I think he liked you. Uh -oh. Wonder what gave it away. Hmm. Yeah, all right. Me, the fact he wanted to dance with you. What the hell? Is this? Is that a bright? Oh, okay. You can't sit more than two people in a chair, Noah. Okay, Tommy. All right. Oh no. He's athletic, and he's handsome. Oh, it's done for. There you go. What? No. No. Hey, Pat. She just told you. Why not? I don't know because I don't want to. <laughs> right, well, you know the choice then. Ah! Oh my God! I'm not kidding. No, stop the What are you doing? Will you? Will you not go out? Shit! But well, this was a power play. Head slipper. The crowd's a fire, you idiots! Not until she agrees. Ah, uh, go out with him, honey. Okay. okay <laughs> fine. I'll go out with you. Well, don't do me any favors. <laughs> <laughs> Say it. I want to go out with you. Say it again. I want to go out with you. All right, all right, we'll go out. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? Please don't do that. Just don't do that part either. Wait, what? Okay. His pants! My man's pants! <laughs> You're not so cocky now, are you? <laughs> I'm gonna get you, Phil. Oh, maybe you will. Maybe you will. What, what? He's just gonna hang up there with his pants down? How do you get down? Climb down. Yeah, I wanted to clear that up with you because I'm really sorry about that. It was a really stupid thing to do. <laughs> Call up the Ferris wheel to talk to somebody. But I had to be next to you. I was being drawn to you. Ooh, drawn. drawn. What are you doing tonight? What? Uh, or tomorrow night or this weekend, whatever. Why? <laughs> He's so Why persistent. Date? What date? The date you agreed to? No. Oh. Yes, you did. You Technically, you did. Well, I guess that changed my mind. Whoa! Oh. He was hanging pants down! I coming up to you on the street, you don't know him. You don't know me, but but I know me. I hope so. And when I see something that I like, I love it. <laughs> wow, all right. Easy for okay, what are you talking about? Well, you. Hey, yo. Oh, he's a smooth talker, ain't he? I could be fun if you want. Pensive, uh, smart. <laughs> be light on my feet. Wow! Do whatever you want. My man can dance. Just did a little bit of tapping. You're dumb. That could be that. <laughs> Come on, one day. What's it gonna hurt? Mm, I don't think so. Well, what can I do to change your mind? Guess you'll figure something out. We'll set up. We're meeting for the late show. Look. He's got it so bad. Yeah, but you know what, man? His persistence is quite, like, admirable. Oh my god! What a coincidence! Oh no! Oh, shit. oh no! It's nice to see you again. Too. You look great. Oh, thanks. Really great. You do look great. You look great. And I know I look great, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, it's smart. Let's go. Uh oh. Yeah, oh. there we go, buddy. That, alright. Big brain moves. Well, it's better to sit beside his friend, like. You don't want to just be around that the whole time. That's weird. Yeah, you're you get them both at third squad. Oh, my. <laughs> Swimming. What are you guys doing? Get What's in. What's going on? We're going to walk. Do you guys love each other? <laughs> what? Oh, I get it. You guys do love each other. Oh, damn. You got the walk. You got the walk, <laughs> man. I haven't seen a movie in ages. Same. Yeah, it's been a long time. I have a very strict schedule. My days are all planned out. I get up in the morning, breakfast, math tutor, Latin tutor, lunch. Oh, you were a nerd. Both French tutor, piano lesson, then I eat dinner, and after dinner, I spend time with my family, and then I, I catch up on some reading. That sounds miserable. Sounds like the road to success. Mm, you bet. We'll find all these colleges, um, Radcliffe, Sarah Lawrence, those are the ones we want. Who's we? Oh, Mom and Daddy. Mm. Oh, so it's what they want. Mm. What? I always <laughs> figured you were kind of free. What? Free? I am free. God, no. Come here, I want to show you something. Well, what are you doing? Just come on. You're going to get run over. Buy all the cars? 
Is that like what Bad night. true freedom is? Can you just get up? That's your problem. You know that? You don't do what you want. Mmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah, this road's dead. What the hell? Yeah, dude. Alright, kind of cool. Maybe I should try this. And what happens if a car comes? You die. <laughs> Painting. Hmm? You asked me what I do for me. Oh. I love to paint. Oh, so there is something. Art. Okay, kind of cringe, but it's okay. <laughs> God, that's screaming. <laughs> There's nothing more fun than almost getting hit by a car. Yeah, dude. It's the thrill. Do you want to dance with me? Oh. Sure. In the street? Damn, yeah, man, you don't need music to dance. Mm-hmm. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Oh, no. The There's room. no way he's gonna, oh, yeah, he's gonna be good at dancing. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, we saw his tapping skills earlier. Mm, yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Oh, no, he's good. Um, 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 um. <laughs> You're a terrible singer. I know. <laughs> but I like this song. Be oh, damn! Well, my man's smooth, dude. Boys, take notes. This is how you do it. Yeah, learn to dance and lay in the like straight shit. and dance in the straight. Oh. Oh. Wow, she oh, really likes him now. That Holy shit! That was terrifying. Boom. You came screaming at me like that. I'd have to like you have to slam you right down on the ground. Boom! Oh. It's like a wild creature. Ooh! What? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Okay. That's really nice. Okay, maybe maybe it wasn't that bad getting the ice cream in the face. Uh, this is Allison Hamilton. Allison, glad to meet you. Allie. Allie. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Kelly. What am I old or something? You call me Frank. <laughs> Big Frank. Big Frank. So Allie, really, she is pretty, son. <laughs> yes, sir, she's a lot prettier than you let on. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't believe what he says. What is this? You got? Um, I I just I brought you something. Hey, yo, what's she, in does there? she paint something? What does she paint? No. Mm -hmm. Well, that's beautiful. Look at that. That's a damn picture there. <laughs> <laughs> that was a lovely poem. See, when, <laughs> when he was a little kid, he used to stutter real bad. Dad? So. Oh. Unbelievable. <laughs> I'm a Tennyson man myself, but he likes Whitman for some reason. I don't know. <laughs> Say, how would you like some breakfast? Would you like some breakfast? It's 10 o'clock. Well, what's that got to do with it? You can have pancakes any damn time of night. Yeah. Yo, his dad's cool. Yeah, that that's that's the truth. What's with her and running and screaming at things? She's enjoying life. Oh, okay, maybe that's why I'm miserable. I'm not running and screaming enough. Yeah, start running and screaming, bro. It'll change your uh, perspective on life. All right. In another life, I could have been a bird. Sure, why not? Why not? Maybe a seagull. But explain the screaming, actually. Right. Just a bird. You're a bird. Nice, you're a bird. Boys, take notes. Call her a bird. I'll say you're a bird too. He's a bird too? You're a bird, I'm a bird. We're all birds! Three! Oh, I can't. Get in the water! Get in! Be a bird! Fly! Be a bird. Wow! <laughs> she screams a lot. Yeah. Oh. I thought she was not going to let go and just swing back. <laughs> In fact, they rarely agreed on anything. They fought all the time. And they challenged each other every day. Whoa! Despite their differences, they had one important thing in common. They were crazy about each other. Oh, okay. Well, oh, 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 my shit. God. Oh, Daddy. I didn't see it there. Whoa! Look at the stash on him! Oh my god! Hey, Daddy. Yeah, oh boy. Little bug goes, Dad, I don't oh, know. He's an asshole. He goes, well. Yeah, in theory. Oh, he looks like one, too. I work at the lumber yard with Finn. Mainly milling and receiving right, logs and stripping the bark. All right. Respectable. Res yeah, very respectable job. We're logging. Yeah, nice. I'm asking, uh, how much do you make at your job? Uh, how much money do I make? 
Oh, you God. Like 40 what an cents insufferable an hour? cock. Dude, what? A, oh, how could you ask that question, man? Much, but I don't, I don't need a lot, and I, I save most of it. All right, good answer, good answer. All right, all That's right. That's a jelly. Yes. Oh, oh, God, man, what an asshole. Like, bro, read the mood. You don't, you, you don't want to ask that question. We've been spending a lot of time together. We must be very fond of each other. Oh, God, this is awkward. No, it's fine. It's getting pretty serious, huh? Oh, oh no. Yes, man. Well, summer's almost gone. What will you do? I mean, Charleston's only a couple of hours away. But Allie's going to Sarah Lawrence. Uh, wait! Didn't she tell you? Oh! Oh, this is the worst time to find that out. And Sarah Lawrence is in New York. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I didn't know that. Oh, no. my God! That was so planned. Oh, my God. I'm going to have fun and... I'm bringing in the Spanish Inquisition. My lips are buttoned right now. I do know another joke about the nun and the false stallion. Oh, bro, no more jokes, please. That child's got too much spirit for a girl of her circumstance. No, he just some of love. Trouble is what it is. Our parents are dicks. They look miserable as shit. That's it. Get it, buddy. Whoa! Whoa! Damn, we copping a handful? God damn! Woo! Uh oh. Do you want to go somewhere? Oh. Okay. Nice abandoned house. <laughs> Alright, stay there. Don't open your eyes. Wow, candles and everything? Windsor Plantation. They built it in 1772. Rumor has it that Francis Marion mm -hmm. proposed to his wife right here on his, uh, his steps. He proposed on the cobwebs. Sorry. Uh, this place is gigantic. Huh? Yeah, a gigantic piece of crap. But <laughs> <laughs> yes. well, I'm gonna buy it one day. I'm gonna fix it up. Oh, nice. Oh. And there's a big old barn up there. I could turn that into my workshop. Well, what about me? Now, don't I get any say in this? Oh. Do you want to say in this? Yes, I would. Wow. Ooh. I want a big old porch that wraps around the entire house. Oh. We can drink tea and watch the sun go down. Oh, tea. Oh, nice. That sounds actually very lovely. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Let's go. Woo! Yo, her parents are going to be pissed off. Oh, God, they Holy are. shit. I know I said that. I wanted you to make love to me, but I think yeah. you're gonna have to talk me through this. Talk through it, okay. Don't hurt you? No, no. I'm just... I'm just having a lot of thoughts. I'm just... I'm just nervous. Like, yeah, very nerve-wracking. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. <Yeah. laughs> Alright. Like, what are you thinking? What are you thinking right now? Nothing. Don't worry Wait about a it. Second. Just get, stay in the moment. You're good. I just don't understand how come you're so quiet. I <laughs> know. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Over here, but no, with you, everything's fine. You don't have a care in the world. I wouldn't have said that, but okay. I love you. Whoa. Whoo! Yo. Did you know that? Hit her with the I love you. Damn. There it is. That's it, oh. baby. The power of love. Let's go. Mm. Let's go. No. Oh, oh God. my God, no! Man, oh, get out of here. God. Look, I'm sorry, but Allie's parents are going crazy. They got every cop in town out looking for her. Why? Oh, shit. What the hell? It's maybe just it's too late. It's, uh... Why are they looking... What's going on? Why are you they... sent the police for me? Yes. It is two in the morning. We sent the police. Two in the morning. Oh. Where you been? Mr. Hamilton, all of this is my fault. Would you give us a moment, please? I'd like to talk to my dog. Oh, God, what a smug piece of shit. Thanks for everything, Lieutenant. You bet, John, anytime. You go straight home, man. Late. Oh, no, what's he gonna say there? Oh, He's dude. just like a prime -A asshole. What are you gonna say, buddy? Sit down. Oh, God. Oh, oh this is not gonna be good. Now, he is a nice boy. He's a nice boy, but he's... He's what? He he's is what? trash! 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 Not for you! Oh. He's nice, but he's trash? How does that make sense? Oh, the poor guy has to hear all this shit. 
That is so heartbreaking. I can't imagine how like cru soul crushing it is to hear the person you love's parents talk such shit about you. Yeah. I love him. You are 17 years old. You don't know anything about love. Oh, and you do? You don't look at daddy the way I look at Noah. You don't. No! Play. You don't know anything about love. Holy shit! Yeah. <laughs> oh, tell mom. Hey! Whoa! Whoa! That was rough. Think about some stuff. What do you gotta think about, huh? You're going away. And I'm so happy that you're doing that. But you're gonna have a million things to do. You got so much ahead of you. It's true. I'm not gonna have nice things, fancy things. It doesn't. Oh, oh my God. I don't have to go to school, okay? Yes, you I do. I can stay here. No. Do you see? That's exactly what I'm talking about. And you can come with me. What am I gonna do in New York? Be with me. Oh. She doesn't get it. No. God, that's hard. We don't gotta figure all this out tonight. You know? We'll finish out the summer and we'll see what happens. Yeah, there's no need to jump to conclusions here. Take it easy. Yeah, but like this whole. Why wait until the summer ends, huh? Why don't you just do it right now? Do it right now! Do it! Don't hit him! Holy shit. Wait, so oh. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna do it. It's over! Okay, it's over! Don't touch me! I hate you! I hate you! Oh. Oh. Just wait a minute. We're not really breaking up, are we? Come on. Oh my this God. is just a fight we're having, and tomorrow to be like it never happened, right? She's kind of crazy. Holy shit! Whoa! You didn't s need to say you hated him. He was only trying to do the right thing. Yeah. 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 But what he really should have done is just told those parents to go to hell. Just stick it where the sun don't shine. <laughs> yeah. True. The next day. Allie woke up to find her world completely changed. Oh, they're just moving her right away? Oh, yeah, straight up. What's going on? We're going home. And we're not supposed to be leaving for another week. Get dressed and then come and have some breakfast, dear. Oh, shit. I'm leaving town. Leaving? Yeah. When? Now, right now, like today. Look, I need you to tell Noah something, okay? I need you to tell him that I love him. And tell him that I'm sorry for everything, okay? Oh, it's over. Don't make it any harder than it already is. No, no, it's not over. Finn, we had a fight last night. We, we said some things we didn't mean, but it's not over. It is over. Leave it alone. Let it go. Uh, I'm coming. Mama, I'm coming. Yeah, this guy is really no help at all. No, he's not. Okay, can you just, can you just tell him that I love him then? Can you do that? I'll tell him. I don't think he no, is. No, he ain't going to say it. He's gonna try and make it as easy as possible and not tell him. Yeah. He wrote to Allie that he was sorry and stupid for breaking up with her. He wrote to tell her that he still loved her and he wanted to see her. Oh no. Oh shit! She was. Oh god, no. no. He oh, wrote one geez. letter a day for a year. 365 letters. Holy shit! So he wrote a farewell letter and he and Finn packed their bags and headed for Atlanta. Wow. Against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Noah and Finn enlisted together. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Man. Oh, my God. Oh, oh God. Oh, shit. Allie was in her third year of college when she volunteered as a nurse's aide. <sighs> Dude, he looks like shit. He got his ass kicked. I noticed that you weren't wearing a ring. And I was wondering if I could take you out. Excuse me? Whoa. Oh. Before you go and say no, I'll have you know that I am an excellent dancer. And my intentions are completely dishonorable. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh miss? I'm all better. Now, how's about that date? Oh no. Oh no. He's also good looking. She fell in love with Lon Hammond. He was handsome, smart. Funny, sophisticated. Oh no, 
He's all of it. Oh, God, no. Horses! It also came from old southern money and was fabulously wealthy. Oh, no! So the parents are gonna love him, too. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> oh, shit, no, dude. Oh, come on! Having a good ass time. Yeah, he's having fun. See, Ali, I think. Damn it, I think you have to marry me. I think you need to marry me. I do. Uh, oh no, no. no. Well, you see, you have to get the permission first. And I think you may have overestimated their affection for you. Is that right? Ooh. Oh. Mm. Why not? Oh, because I asked them already, and they said yes. What? Oh! Oh no! Go to hell! <laughs> I know I kid around a lot, but I'm crazy about you. Somebody kill him! Maybe. Make me the happiest man in the world. No! <laughs> yes. Yes, <laughs> yes. It's done. It's over. But couldn't understand why at the very moment she said yes, Noah's face came to her mind. Dude, he's gonna be oh, far God, more Noah. depressed now. No, he uh, lost his best friend. He lost his best. He lost his girl. He lost his best friend. I sold the house. Oh, you sold the house? Yep. Between that and your GI Bill, you ought to be able to get it now. Get what? Your dream house, the Windsor Plantation. Dad. Oh. No, don't dad me. I don't want to hear about. It. Wow. Well, I can't let you sell your house. It's done. It's a good thing. You should do it. Oh my god, dude, his dad's so cool. Oh my god. What a good father. House where you gonna live? With you, dummy, what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's, that's amazing. That's sweet, man. Holy shit. And when Noah went to Charleston to get the building plans approved, fate stepped in dealt him a sweet card. No. No, god damn. Oh, oh god. No! Oh, this timing is so awful. This is terrible. When Noah's father died in November, wow! the house was all he had. Jesus Christ. Dude just losing everything. Everything's just dying on him. $50,000. That's more than my asking price. That's right. It's a great deal. Whoa! <laughs> As over his price, that no one in his right mind would do that and he wouldn't have a lunatic living in his house. He worked out his frustration with life on the creek every morning. Oh. Oh. So things to temper the sting of loneliness. There was Martha Shaw. Martha was a war widow who lived in Quail Ridge, a town away. Ah. Uh. Mama, look, the governor's coming. You better. Let me see. The governor? Oh, shit. Oh, boy. Oh, shit. Oh, shit! <laughs> yeah, that's a bit bizarre. I used to paint all the time. You know, I really loved it. I didn't know that. Yeah, I'm gonna start. Okay. The, the, Great. You need a, does she just come all the way here to tell them I'm gonna paint? Mm-hmm. I need to take care of a few things. Okay. I need to clear my head. Okay, should I be worried? No, I don't think so. Oh, that's... That's reassuring. Yeah, that's very concerning. Are you all right? Yeah. Okay. Then go. Take your time. Do whatever you need to do. Oh, no. He's that's a good okay guy. Way. He's reasonable as shit. Oh, no. I saw your picture in the paper, and I just wanted to come and see if you were okay. I mean, I, I wasn't in the neighborhood or anything. I just... Oh, jeez. So are you okay? No! Okay, good. What? Yeah, this is awkward as shit. Uh, I'm a stupid woman. I shouldn't have come. Rose of disbelief. This, this fencing. You killed his fence. Hammond Cotton. As in Hammond Cotton. Well, your parents must love him. Yeah. He's a really good man, Noah. You'd really like him. 
Don't say that. Don't say that. Don't say that. Well, that's that. You marry Lauren, and we can be friends. Right. You want to stay for dinner? Dinner? I have to warn you, I'm a cheap drunk. A couple more of these, and you're going to be carrying me right out of here. Well, you can go slow, then. I don't want to have to take advantage of you. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> this room. Is this where... This is the room? Uh-oh. The piano's there. Do you think you could come back tomorrow morning? There's some place I'd like to show you. Oof. Is that possible? Oof. See? Okay. Oh, oh, God. I don't know where this is heading. When you didn't call, I got worried. Where have you been? You all right? You know, I feel like an idiot because I called your hotel about a hundred times. Mm, shit! <laughs> I'm fine. Anything you want to tell me? No. No? No. Gosh, she's being so suspicious. Oh, shit. Mom, I love you. Call you tomorrow. Okay. Oh, he knows. He probably mentioned it to her parents. Oh, 100%. He has a good relationship with them, I'm assuming, so... Yeah, 100%. He knows what's going down. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. So many of these little guys. Yeah, they're cute. That's actually kind of cool. Could they uprise and take over the planet? Yeah. Why not? You're different. What do you mean? It's the way you look. Everything. Well, yeah, he... You look different, too, but in a good way. <laughs> nice. Hmm. The house. It's beautiful what you did. Well, I promise you I would. Shit. Damn, bro. Whoa. Yeah, you're not making it. Nice. <laughs> Yo, that's a lot of rain. That's some torrential rain, dude. Why didn't you write me? Me. I waited for you. Shit! Now it's too late. I wrote you 365 letters. You wrote me? It wasn't over. It still isn't over. Whoa! Whoa! What Whoa! the? Whoa! He just went in there! Oh shit! Whoa! It was... Whoa! Oh, God! Oh! Whoa! What the? What are you? What the? Uh oh. What about that long guy? Whatever his name is. Yeah. Long ham or something. <laughs> long ham? I can't remember his name. <laughs> what if you were coming here, wouldn't have been better off calling off the wedding and then breaking up with the guy then coming here? This is a bit bizarre. Yeah, this is really bizarre. Like, he seemed like a pretty decent guy at the end. Just I don't like, think he's going to be all that decent anymore. I don't blame him, though. Oh! I heard car doors. Yep, here it comes. Ah! Whoa! Oh, shit! Oh, God, no! Run! No! Oh! Get out, leave something, please. Oh no. Oh, don't do that. Oh. Don't do that, don't do that. She's the one, isn't she? Oh. Damn straight, baby. Can I meet her? No. No! That's so weird. Spare yourself. Oh, shit. Hi. Hi. <laughs> that is weird. This is Funny. so awkward. All right. We're going in. Well, I'm pretty sure she was always aware that she wasn't uh, the first choice. I feel bad for her still. Mm -hmm. Power to her to actually go in there. But wow. That's wild. She's sensational. Yep. Sensational. No, <gasps> fuck. No way, no way, no way. Ah, boss! Ah, shit! It's mom! Oh, God. <laughs> it's so over. It's, it's so done. Tell me about the letters, Mother. Is mm. it true? How could you do that? I'm sorry. You're sorry. Yes, You're I am. Sorry. I am because sorry. Because of you, my entire life is ruined. Okay, yes, I stole your letters. It was wrong. But stop being dramatic and at least take some of the responsibility. Huh? You knew what you were doing. You knew this would happen. Oh, so now I'm a tramp. You are unbelievable. Let's take a drive. Why would I want to go anywhere with you? Because I might know you a little better than you think. Uh-oh. Oh. Do you see that man there? Mm -hmm. 25 years ago. Oh, my goodness. He was really something. Holy shit! Naturally, your grandfather was furious, so 
We decided to run away. We didn't even make the next town before the police picked us up. You know, sometimes when I'm in the area, I stop here and I'm watching. Hey, yo. I want you to know that I love your father. He is good to me and I don't deserve it. I love him, Ellie. I do. I love him. God damn. Well, that makes a lot of sense now, actually. Yeah. She's just trying to protect her. I was not expecting that. That was uh, wild. <gasps> the l oh shit! She kept him. I hope you make the right choice. Yeah. Longham is so dead. It's so over for Longham, dude. You're born. You know it. You wouldn't be here if there wasn't something missing. Would you just stay with me? Stay with you? What for? Look at us. We're already fighting. Well, that's what we do. <laughs> we fight. <laughs> I'm not afraid to hurt your feelings. They have like a two-second rebound rate, and you're back doing the next pain in the ass thing. <laughs> Shit. Stop thinking about what I want, what he wants, what your parents want. What do you want? It's not that simple. What it's... do you want? It is that simple. Yep. I have to go. Ah. Like. Is she, she just doesn't. Is get Longham it. even gonna want you? No. Like. I mean, no reasonable human being would. Oh god. There's no way you show your face to Longham. Or Long, whatever the f I can't remember his name. Just Long. Unless Longham doesn't know the full story. Probably doesn't. I don't know, man. You look like shit. This is gonna be weird. The way I see it, I got three choices. Oh, three? One, I can shoot him. <laughs> oh, wow. Nice. I can kick the crap out of him. Okay. Or three, I leave you. But, oh, that's no good. None of those options give me you. Yep. Ooh. And in spite of everything, I love you. Oh. <laughs> no, you don't. Sayonara, Longham. Goodbye, Longham. It was us. Oh, it was darling. us. Oh, my sweetheart. <laughs> oh. 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 Well, after that kind of experience, you know, it's a very stressful. That was a lot of stress on him, yeah. Alright, we just watched uh, The Notebook. Yeah, uh, wow. It's actually a pretty good movie. It was, was it. it was nothing I expected it to be. Much more depressing than I thought it would be. And it's uh, not, like, not really, but yes. Yeah. You know, I, like... Especially for Noah, you just feel like shit for Noah. That's it, man. You feel bad for him. That's it. That man goes through so much. My God. Goes through the death of his best friend, the death of his father. And it just it feels like he never had anyone there to be with. Like, the death of his best friend, of course, his father was there for him. Yeah. But after the death of his father, nobody was there for him. Well, he had that woman that he was kind of like... Yeah, and they were kind like, of using each other in a sense for their loneliness. Yeah. You, you could tell that was the case, and she was very self-aware of what if that was. Yeah. That's how the relationship was established. And, you know, he finally, he got what he wanted. Yeah. And it's just like, oh, man. Just the, the, the fact that no matter what, like, in the end. Love prevails. It's not even just that, but the fact that he would do his best every day to make her remember, even if it was only those five minutes. They were the most precious thing in, in his life. I don't know, it's true love, dude. True love is a, a powerful thing. Love makes people do some of the craziest things. If anything, you know? If you know, you know. Yeah, I feel like a massive asshole when I said dementia in the, in the beginning as a joke. Holy you know shit. what? As soon as you said dementia is... Man, when, when, when dude. The, right when I showed her, like... When you said dementia, I was just like, dude, this is gonna bite you in the ass really hard. I feel like... Whenever yeah, I, when I, I, as soon as the movie was progressing, I was like... Oh, shit! As, as soon as you know it's a... It shows, like, an elderly person, Chris. Dementia usually comes into play. Yeah, I know. It usually I've comes into play. I've dealt with it quite a few times. Yeah, so I was just like, mm, I don't know about that one. But, I mean, like, it's fairly obvious that who, uh, you know, the older man and the older woman is... Uh, yeah, it was woman. very you, obvious. You know it is, man. Like, yeah. It, if you didn't find out within the first 30 minutes, I don't know what to tell you. All right, but a that was slow. that was very obvious, you know. But it, it doesn't ruin the film in any sorts. It's not supposed to be some big reveal or anything like that. You pay attention, you could just figure it out like that. Yeah, if anything. But I think it was just a really good story. I said it's, it's, it's a really good love story. Like no wonder there's like a lot of people when these when you when you hear about romance films, the Notebook is like the first one mentioned. Yeah, you know, 
For some reason, I feel like that's a, a like, lot of people mention. A lot of people mention it. Like it, it was when it came out. This was popular, man. Oh God! Wow! I like we are we've heard of the Notebook before, just because it, when it came out, it, it women loved it. All right, some guys probably did too. I women loved it. All right, that's who always told me every time I talked about a girl and they're talking about romance. Notebook comes up. Notebook comes up, man. And I guess it's just be, because of like. It's because I guess it's something that they're looking for. You know, I guarantee you there's a lot of people out there that are looking for a lot of It's not a lot of love. people. I think everyone would have. Really well, that's what I'm saying. A lot of people. Want. Well, some people don't care. There are there's a small minority that don't. care. I think deep down they care. Sure. All right. I think um, it's easy to say you don't care because it makes you feel better, but deep down you do care. All right. Sure. And uh, it's just like it's that like. I think it's just that kind of love that is timeless. The unconditional, it's love. unconditional, sincere, and it's just like. More than anything, I think that's what draws a lot of people because you know, it's a wonderful thing. Yeah, it's it's corny and cheesy as it is, guys. Love's genuinely a great thing. For those of you who have not experienced it, I genuinely feel sorry for you. That's I genuinely do. It exists. It's out there. I'm someone who truly believes in it. Uh, it's out there, but the sad thing is, is that you got to go looking for it. It's not going to come looking for you. Yeah. You know, like for example, I mean, this character uh, Noah himself proves that time and time again you know he saw a girl he liked her and he was just like i want her that's it and, you know he put himself out there he did some stupid things to get her attention and whatnot some real not saying that shit. you need to do stupid things but you know he generally put an effort he put himself out there in awkward situations just to try to get to know her or try to uh make himself m be memorable to her exactly you know try to stand out and stuff like that you know to put effort in that you know yeah it's, it's, there's a very Fine difference between being creepy and charming. Yeah, and but you also like, you gotta look you, like Ryan Gosling. You gotta look like Ryan fair. Gosling, and it'll never look creepy. It'll always yeah. be charming. So, so if you don't look like Ryan Gosling, I'm sorry. Maybe don't hang from a uh, a carnival ride Ferris wheel. without a Ferris wheel without your pants. It won't work. For, it won't work all the time. You know, you yeah. have to be handsome. Keep the pants on. Keep the pants on. You know. Yeah, I don't know. I, I like this movie more than I thought. Yeah. I have a it? lot to say about it, but I'm just gonna save it for. Oh, the, you just uh, want to save it for the podcast? Yeah, I think that's the best thing to do. It's okay. already five minutes, man. Already? Yeah. Oh wow. But like, I got a lot to say. And I, I actually think... have a lot to say about this one. Yeah, um, so I think we're gonna save it and we're gonna enjoy it. We'll save it for the podcast, guys. If you actually want to hear about uh, what we think about the Notebook, I also had like some cheesy ass story I was gonna tell you guys that's gonna make me look like an absolute fool, but I thought it would be very fitting. Tune in for the cheese. Tune in for the cheese, guys. Uh, it's going to get sappy, and you will never see me the same again. All right. Adios, guys. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. Remember, the power of love always prevails, especially if you're Ryan Gosling. Adios, guys. I love you, Ryan Gosling. Love you, Ryan Gosling. Bye. <laughs>